everybody, it's Paige, and today's video is going to be my January 2020 BoxyCharm unboxing. I am so excited because this is my first BoxyCharm video of the year, and you guys know how much I love BoxyCharm. I have two boxes to open up for you guys today. We have the base box, which is $25 a month. It includes five full-size products and has a value of over $125. And then we also have BoxyCharm Premium, which is $35 a month. It includes six to seven full-size items, and has a guaranteed value of over $175. I do want to give the disclaimer that both of these boxes were sent to me as PR, but this video is not sponsored in any way, and I even pay for my own BoxyCharm subscription because I love it that much. I used to do a lot of PR versus purchase BoxyCharm unboxings on my channel, so if you're interested in seeing some of those videos, I will link my BoxyCharm playlist down below, but I don't get those boxes until much later on in the month, so it kind of delays my video a bit, but I can definitely update you guys on the product that I receive in those boxes versus my PR boxes on my Instagram story. So make sure you follow me on Instagram for updates like that. But we're just going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to start off with the base box, which is the $25 a month box. I am so excited about this month because I've seen some sneak peeks on BoxyCharm's Instagram and I'm so excited. By the way, just in case you're interested, the eyeshadow that I have on today is from the Mercury Retrograde Palette by Huda Beauty. And then my lipstick is the Laura Mercier lipstick stick in the shade beige in time I'm obsessed with how my makeup turned out today I think it's like so fun and cute so yeah just wanted to share that info with you guys really quick but now we're gonna go ahead and get into the base box so this month's theme is breaking the ice look at how cute this card is I'm so excited so this box does include five items so we're just gonna dive right in the first product is from Too Faced this is a makeup item this is the diamond light highlighter I am so excited to see this in here because I've seen these highlighters and the packaging is so freaking stunning but I actually don't own any of them so this retails for $36 and it says this one-of-a-kind highlighter is infused with a real crushed diamond powder and light reflecting pearls for a brilliant fancy pink diamond glow that will have you on planet shimmer I love that each highlighter is created with our unique marble pouring technique ensuring no two highlighters will ever look the same just like a real diamond how cute is that so so this is what the packaging itself looks like so stunning the packaging is to die for so even the outer unit carton is kind of like like a ring box or something and then the actual product is inside and this is what the powder looks like it is beautiful it's pressed almost like a diamond I love this so much this one is in the shade fancy pink diamond Let's go ahead and give this a swatch. It's so soft. It kind of feels like the hourglass highlighting powders. I am so sorry about that. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, I actually have four dogs, so my house can get pretty noisy at times. They've been pretty well behaved recently, but when they get playing, there's just, they, I, there's nothing I can do about it. So anyway, this is the swatch of that Too Faced highlighter. It is so beautiful. I feel like the camera is not even doing it justice. The next product we have is the Dr. Brandt 24-7 Retinol Eye Cream. This retails for $55, and this says, all eyes are on you with this potent yet gentle, light reflecting and age fighting eye cream, a perfect combination of retinol and ruby crystal complex that gives your eyes the attention they deserve. Here is what the product itself looks like. I'm personally a really big fan of Dr. Brandt products. This eye cream feels so amazing. It feels extremely moisturizing and hydrating without being like oily or slippery. I feel like it'll absorb into the skin very quickly and just like plump up your under eye area. So I cannot wait to try this out. The next product is the Skin & Co Truffle Therapy Face Gommage. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it is a delicate exfoliating cream with a rich texture and soothing fragrance. It is a lush formula combining the best of iconic Mediterranean lifestyle and luxury Italian spa experience. It gently buffs away and erases dull lackluster skin, revealing a more luminous and healthy complexion. So I've actually tried products from this brand before and I've been a really big fan so I'm really excited to try this out I love exfoliators so much one of my favorite products of all time skincare body care 
literally everything. I love exfoliators and I don't think I've ever gotten one in a boxy charm before so I'm really excited to see this in here and I can't wait to try it out and let you guys know my thoughts. Next we have a product from the brand Avant I think is how it's pronounced. Um, we received a product from this brand in I think December's box. This retails for $107 which is absolutely insane. Like that's so much money. This is the 8 hour radiance renewal sleeping mask. I'm a big fan of a good sleeping mask. I actually bought one today <laughs> from Drunk Elephant so I'm really excited to try this one out as well. I've actually been experiencing a little bit of dryness in random areas on my skin for some reason. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I feel like it's the cooler weather. It's been cool like cold slash cool the last few days here in Florida So I feel like my skin's been freaking out a bit, but anyway needless to say I'm excited about this product It says the eight hour radiance renewal sleeping mask works to reveal more youthful and beautiful skin overnight It also helps to tighten the skin and lessen the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines And then the very last product in this box is actually from Grande Cosmetics This brand is found at Sephora and this is the Grande Dry Drama Intense Thickening Mascara. This retails for $25 and it says, designed by the maker of cult favorite Grande Lash MD Lash Enhancing Serum, Grande Cosmetics introduces the hottest secret weapon for lashes that command attention. The No Flake Intense Black Formula works while you wear it, creating unrivaled thickness through key ingredient castor oil. So I don't know that I've ever used a mascara that has castor oil in it. Maybe I have and just didn't know it, but I think I think it's an interesting thing that this is marketed as that. Also, I was gonna say there's no unicarton on here, but it's actually sealed in plastic, which I think is really nice. And this mascara component is thick, <laughs> like this is crazy. So I'm really excited to try this out. I'm always down to try a new mascara. So that is everything in the BoxyCharm base box. I'm gonna go ahead and add up the total retail value for this box and I will be right back. So the total retail value for this BoxyCharm base box is $251 and it costs $25. That is absolutely insane. I BoxyCharm blows my mind each and every month. I say this in every single video. I don't know how they do it. I love seeing brands that I recognize like Too Faced, Grande Cosmetics, Dr. Brandt, Skin & Co. The only one that was introduced to me through BoxyCharm is this Avant brand, but it's super expensive. So I'm all down to try some nice luxury skincare for an affordable price. So um, anyway, that was the base box. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the BoxyCharm premium box. This again has the breaking the ice theme. So the first product in this box is ooh, again from Too Faced. This is the Palm Springs Dreams palette. How cute is this? Oh my gosh. This retails for $45 and that's already more than the box itself costs so it's already a good deal. <laughs> it says make it a girl's trip to remember with the, this Palm Springs Dreams inspired palette of fresh cocktail colors and dazzling party ready finishes extreme color payoff in a one swipe formula so let's go ahead and take a peek at this palette I've, I've been a really big fan of Too Faced palettes but I haven't actually received or purchased any of the newer ones like the uh, gingerbread ones or anything like that so this one is so cute I love the packaging pink and orange is one of my all-time favorite color combos that was like when I was a kid and someone asked me what my favorite color was I would say pink and orange <laughs> so I already am a sucker for this packaging and then this is what the palette itself looks like I think this is beautiful I love that there are warm tones with like a pop of blue and pink super fun and like natural yet like kind of party fun so let's go ahead and do some swatches this one here is called swizzle stick that is beautiful we'll go ahead and swatch swank byob this is a matte brown holy crap and then we'll do dirty martini here are the swatches on the back of my hand this is so creamy and buttery and pigmented definitely a one swipe formula i can't wait to try this out on the eyes i think the colors are so fun it's gonna be great for summertime and even spring it's this i feel like could be an all year round palette because i feel like it's got some like fall colors but also summer and spring mixed in here so we're off to a great start. The next item in here is from Laneige. This is the uh, Mousse Moisturizer. This retails for $29 and it says blend it to perfection with nutrient rich deep sea water and polyphenols. I don't know if I said that right. <laughs> from Lychee. 
peel extract. This moisturizer quickly whips into action to deliver instant soothing relief to visibly stressed skin. The non-sticky mousse formula makes it ideal for all skin types. So I have very oily, acne prone skin. I feel like most people have dry skin for some reason. I don't know if it's just me and the people that I watch, but I feel like everybody has dry skin and it's a struggle to find somebody that has oily skin to get recommendations from. So I'll definitely be trying this out for you guys. I've actually had this in the past. I used it a few times and I was a really big fan, but I don't remember exactly like what I liked about it or didn't like about it. So I am excited to give this another go and update you guys with my thoughts on this. I love Laneige, one of my favorite brands of all time. This next product I am shook about. This is from Farsali. This is the Liquid Glass Radiance Serum. It retails for $54. Farsali is so expensive, but I love their products so much. They're coming out with a new product and I can't wait to try it. It's like a liquid to powder or something or other. I don't know. I saw it on Trend Mood and I need to try it. This says this is a hybrid skincare serum that hydrates the skin leaving a radiant glow with hyaluronic acid to plump and improve the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It can be used as a hydrating skincare serum or a radiance boosting primer before makeup. So I actually already have this product and I love it. <laughs> I use it as a primer and I think that it works so beautifully on the skin. I think it works great under a matte foundation. I just think it kind of gives it a nice balance. I will go ahead and get mine and show you what it looks like. So here's what the product itself looks like. This is the one that I already do own. I love this so much. It comes in a really cute like dropper packaging and I usually use like Hmm, I would say like four or five drops of this which is kind of a lot and I just rub it all over the skin and it leaves me with a beautiful radiant finish and then I pack on the matte foundation and powder on top and I just think it gives a nice a natural look or more natural look to my skin so I'm very happy to see this in this month's box. It's getting a little hot up in here. <laughs> anyway moving on to the next product we have a product from Kat Von D. This is the uh, Lolita eyeshadow. Lolita was like their like most iconic product of all time. This retails for $19 and it says Kat Von D's Lolita eyeshadow is triple milled and insanely pigmented in her signature matte eyeshadow formula for a soft seamless blend every time. Rock a rosy eye and top it off with a Lolita lip for the ultimate monochromatic look. I will say I love a good monochromatic look. I'm not interested in trying this product out personally but it is really pretty to be honest. I think the color Lolita is a very beautiful shade, but I will be going ahead and passing this on to somebody else. Next, we have a product from the brand Saint Lux Beauty, which I've never heard of before. This is the Eyeliner Trio. This retails for $55, and it says, the perfect trio. <laughs> That's the description. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> a mix of your three must-have liners in bronzed, nude, and black. Saint Lux is bringing you a budge-proof gel-based liner that glides on effort effortlessly and lasts all day long. So let's go ahead and take a peek at these liners. Ooh, here they are right here. They are all individually wrapped, which it's going to take me a minute to open these, but I will do so so we can do some fun swatches. I do like that there's a trio in here. I don't typically use a bunch of the eyeliners that come in BoxyCharm boxes just because I don't really wear eyeliner very often in general, um, but I am really interested, especially in this nude shade. So I'm going to go ahead and open these up, swatch them for you, and I will be right back. All right, so it wasn't too terribly hard to open up the liners. Here are the swatches right here. I will say that the formula is a bit on the drier side, but but these are very pigmented and bold, so I'm really excited to play around with these in the future. I think that this nude one is like so cool. It's like the color of my skin, essentially. So I think this will be really fun to play around with. And I mean, I think it's really cool that there's like three of them. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> anyway, moving on to the last product in the box, we have something from Billion Dollar Brows. This is the Best Sellers Kit. This retails for $42. This is a brand that I have seen uh, kind of like an emerging brand of the last like six months or so. Um, so this says, transform your brows with these essential brow products. Use the universal brow pencil to sculpt your desired look with the Brow Duo pencil. Highlight the brow bone for an 
instant lift and define with concealer above the brow blend highlight and conceal with the smudge brush for a flawless finish and complete with a top coat of brow gel for an all-day lasting hold so um this is what the kit comes with there are four products in here so let's go ahead and open this up and see exactly what is inside so we have the billion dollar brows brow gel this is the brush that comes in the kit it's like a flat uh brush <laughs> I don't know how else to describe it. Um, this is the Billion Dollar Brows. Oh, Concealer and Highlight Duo. I'm really... Oh, cute. So this is the conceal side. <gasps> wow. That is so creamy. Like, you can, like, barely even see it. And then this is the highlight side. It doesn't have any shimmer to it. It is just, like, a lighter shade. I think of the same formula product. It feels very similar if it's not the same. And then here is the brow pencil itself. It comes with a spoolie on one side. And then, <gasps> yes a retractable pencil on the other i love that i cannot wait to try this out this one is in the shade does this have a shade oh it's a universal brow pencil so it must be like the universal shade um so here is like kind of like a bigger swatch of it right here you can definitely go lighter handed lighter handed you can use a lighter hand or like a more intense pressure to get a different effect so this will be really fun i have been playing around with my brows a little bit more recently so i cannot wait to try all of these products out and the total retail value of this box is 244 dollars which it costs 35 dollars so amazing value right there but i will say that this month's base box value is actually higher than the premium box value which both of them exceed exceed my expectations when it comes to boxycharm um but I, I also would have to say if i had to pick which one i like better this month i think i'm gonna have to go with premium i feel like i really like the products better in the premium box this month even though i love both of them both of them did not disappoint i think they're both amazing again probably one of my favorite months so far so super impressed with both boxes but i feel like boxycharm premium won the battle of the boxes for me this month what do you guys think let me know down below in the comments also don't forget to check out the link in my description box if you're interested in signing up i will also have more information to more of what boxycharm has to offer they offer so much they recently like stepped up their game and i think it's so amazing so i will have all that information in the description box for you guys to check out so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up i love you guys so much i hope you all have a wonderful day and i will see you in the next one bye